hello everyone uh, in this video i will show you how to get sequence of any gene using ensemble genome browser i have already made videos on getting sequence uh, using ucsc genome browser or uh, ncbi database so if you are interested in watching those videos i will provide the link of those videos in the description so let's start so first of all you need to open the genome uh, ensemble genome browser i will provide its link in the description of this video and you have to select the species for which you are uh, getting sequence so i am interested in sheep i will click on sheep and the gene in which i am interested is uh, igf1 so i will search for it so uh, i will open this first link so here is the detail of complete detail of our gene it's uh, uh, it is present on chromosome number three and it has one transcript a gene might have several transcript but this gene has only one transcript and transcript is a complete set of exons in a gene so to get sequence we will just click on this sequence and we will open this in new tab but if you want to explore more explore uh, the transcript we will click on this uh, so this transcript has five exons and if you want to further explore this exons you can click on this exons to further explore this region so here is the complete detail of this uh, transcript and here are also shown some of the variants which are reported in this gene so if you are interested in getting details of this gene uh, the way about the variants you can just click on the variant to which uh, uh, you are interested and you can further explore it okay but uh, but what uh, for what we are interested in we are uh, just interested in getting the sequence of this gene so uh, the other tab which uh, we have opened already so i will go there and here is complete sequence so in which the this first sequence is upstream sequence and the all the uh, exons are in uh, highlighted here so this one is first exon so you can check and the other one this one is uh, intron and complete intron this one is again exon so you can find uh, the exon or intron to which you are interested so if you want to download this sequence you will just click on this download sequence and uh, and you can select cdna sequence coding sequence amino acid sequence exons or anything you are inter interested but what in what we are interested uh, now is we need this complete genomic sequence so i will click on this and if you need any further uh, upstream sequence you can change it to which you are interested or you can even change the downstream sequence if you need or not so you will just click on this download and this sequence will be downloaded okay so this was all about today's video thank you for watching